fasten your seatbelt, slut puppy. I made the beds, I washed the dishes, scoured the pots, cleaned the bathroom, folded the laundry, took out the garbage. My, my. did you attend a military school? <laughs> no, she lived with me. <laughs> George, when I'd hear a noise, I'd wake him up, and then he'd take out his gun, and then he'd have to find the bullets, because I'd always hide the bullets, and then when he found the bullets, we'd make love. <laughs> Can you tell a story? Hi. You're Blanche's daughter, the model. I fantasize about him all day. Last night I dreamed I was Joan of Arc and he was coming at me with a hose. I wouldn't give up having you for anything in the world. Thanks, Ma. And I knew you'd be special. Uh, and I didn't disappoint you. A little. <laughs> I think there's a connection between your brain and wallpaper paste. I'm all set. What's with Satan's secretary? <laughs> oh, Dorothy, a man called for you while you were out. Finally, now we can break out that bottle of champagne we've been saving. Ma, Ma you know you have to have a physical. <laughs> What do you want me to do? Take you to court? Have you declared incompetent? I'm not incompetent. Once, when I laughed too hard, I had a little accident. <laughs> and this is my mother, Sophia. Uh, it's nice to meet you all. <laughs> so, Becky, what brings you to Miami? My guess is a small barge. <laughs> Ma, I do not snore. Please, I had to turn you from the window so you wouldn't inhale the drapes. I said it before and I'll say it again. Sluts just heal quicker. <laughs> makes me feel young and beautiful and special. When we're together, we laugh a lot. Why wouldn't you? You're both naked. <laughs> no matter how bad things get, remember these sage words. You're old, you're sad, get over it. <laughs> this watch is broken. <laughs> Ma, Stan gave me that watch when we got married. Well, the marriage never worked. Why should the watch? <laughs> Last evening at dinner, when Miss McGlynn saw Blanche give Kendall Nesbitt her key, she was furious. She dropped a steak knife into her purse. Big deal, I took a whole place in Not now! I don't believe in hitting children. Personally, I like to lay into a kid with a melon ball. It's got a nice weight, good balance in the hand, and it's portable. Forgive me, Rose, but I haven't had sex in 15 years and it's starting to get on my nerves. You know, Ma, you're really making me feel very bad. You keep telling me how hard it was and how long it took to have me. Did I mention the colic? <laughs> Ma, you're hurting my feelings. Not as much as you hurt my uni. Ma! In many ways, I, I feel just the way I felt when I was a virgin. <laughs> I mean, the feeling isn't going to last long. Are you implying I lost my virginity at an early age? I'm just saying you're lucky Jack and Jill magazine didn't have a gossip column. Mm -hmm. Jealousy is a very ugly thing, Dorothy. And so are you in anything backless. I cannot remember when I had a sponge cake quite so moist. <laughs> Extremely moist. The moistest. <laughs> I found the tea rather moist as well. Now, you're always a bit ornery, unpleasant, impolite, even downright mean. That's part of your charm. Thank you, you bed-hopping relic. <laughs> Jean is a nice person. She happens to like girls instead of guys. Some people like cats instead of dogs. Frankly, I'd rather live with a lesbian than a cat. <laughs> Unless the lesbian sheds, that I don't know. I don't really mind Clayton being homosexual. I just don't like him dating men. You really haven't grasped the concept of this gay thing yet, have you? There must be homosexuals who date women. Yeah, they're called lesbians.
worthless. You're nothing but a backstabbing Judas in sensible shoes. You're a two-lira tramp with cheap bridge work. May you put your dentures in upside down and chew your head off. Are you crazy? What will the neighbors think if they see two men in my bedroom? They'll think it's Tuesday. Hello, Fidel. Hello, Blash. How are you? You don't have cataracts, you tell me. <laughs> Bain it, you 50-year-old mattress. <laughs> Blanche is telling a story. Oh, sorry. Go on. I was 19. Fine. <laughs> oh, well, I thought she was finished. She just said she was 19. Well, look at her now. You don't call that a tragedy? <laughs> oh, you don't have to worry about me, honey. I never get sick. I take very good care of myself. I treat my body like a temple. Yeah, it opens everyone, day or night. <laughs> I'm not going to stand for this. Take it, Dorothy. But I bet you'll lay down for it. <laughs> well, that was just plain rude. <laughs> Arrested for prostitution. I can't believe it. <laughs> Sophia, we're innocent. I know that. I can't believe these dumb cops would think anyone would pay money to sleep with you. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go take a long, hot, steamy bath. <laughs> with just enough water to barely cover my perky bosoms. You're only gonna sip an inch of water?